what is up you guys welcome back to the channel it's your girl okay we got a long vloggy today so stay tuned got hubby with me hello you know what i'm doing i hope you're doing good so we're here at a new chinese place so hubby picked it out um you picked it up well you were like oh let's go somewhere new so yeah so he's like let's go somewhere new try something different so that's what we're gonna do today and you know we gotta feed mr nugget it is so cold here in Alaska. <sighs> Girl. Chow. Ooh, chow. It is. Let me show you guys how cold it is. We did try that new place. Disgusting. It was bad. Salt and pepper, shrimp with lo mein. Two I things that you can't go wrong with. We, we're not the type of people to be like, oh, you they know. They said house sauce, but they put salad dressing on top of that sushi. Yeah. That's crazy if you guys do. We're not the type of people to be like, oh, we don't like this place just because. This wasn't hitting. So today in Alaska, y'all, it is freezing. Like I don't know if you guys can tell. It's freezing, y'all. It is negative 10. I'm surprised it's not colder than that. It feels like negative 20. We be talking about bricking in the East Coast. This is <laughs> this is great. This is bonkers. Sipping on right now. I'm sipping on that hot cocoa right now. I ain't gonna lie. Slow break. Go grocery shop. We're gonna go to Costco first. We gotta go to Walmart. We're gonna go to Castito. Castito, cola catapito. Bro, what are you talking about, man? Are your K cups in this aisle? Yeah, but those aren't the K cups. Hey guys, we just left Costco. It's so cold here. It's freezing. So, hubby is. Let me put the heat up for him. Hubby is putting all the groceries away and I'm just gonna organize the list that we have because look my nose is all red I'm gonna organize the list that we have because some things we get from Costco some things we get to, from Walmart I figured it'll be so much easier to just do like cans at Walmart because I think Walmart's cheaper girl we gotta save a buck because if you know Alaska's expensive so Think about your regular, you know, your regular fees that you pay. Girl, our stuff has to get shipped out here. So think about it. We're paying probably not only inflation rates. I'm pretty sure we're also paying like the rates that they have to pay for like shipping and all that stuff. So Alaska, if you want to move out here for good, honey boo boo, let it just be a vacation place. Unless you want to be spending $400. Okay. My nails gotta get done, you guys. I got mom nails right now. But I miss my long nails. I used to get long nails all the time, but I'm gonna be a mom soon, so I don't think that's happening anytime soon. You guys. It is so damn cold. It's ridiculous. I'm just gonna put this in the car. Get you a man that's gonna do it, cuz these delicate fingers. Ouch. Oh my god, I'm already tired. Girl, being pregnant, you get tired from the littlest things. Can we just talk about like appreciating not only God, have being grateful and having gratitude towards our Lord because we serve such a good God, right? But also the people that he puts in our lives. Girl, bless and just be thankful of all the people that God puts in your life. And I'm not trying to toot my husband's horn, but he that man, girl. He's that man. And I'm always going to talk about it, okay? I'm always talk about it. So I think, honestly, if you are a woman of God as well. Phone disconnected. If you're a woman of God as well and you're looking for someone you know to start a life with or just be in covenant with look for someone who shows those qualities before you marry them okay so you know i knew that my husband was nurturing i knew that he was a provider and loving and christ-like way before i seen those qualities in him way before we got married so if you're looking for someone to marry or someone to start you know dating Look for those things because those are the things that will sustain you as a woman in your relationship. 
it's crazy because I used to really be one of those girls that oh hubby's back I used to be one of those girls that just wanted to provide 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 I become the princess of the house and it's all thanks to this man period these hands are so cool So we just got back home, got some of the groceries, there's still a whole bunch inside of the car, but let's start putting some stuff away. your girl took a nap ate something because after doing all those errands i get so tired it's crazy i do like the littlest things and i get tired my baby boy's room nesting again so we got this cute little wallpaper i'm gonna put it like near the front of the door we got his changing pad changing table thing that's gonna go on top of the dresser as well as this super cute diaper caddy and it has like little compartments in there and I'm gonna link this on my Amazon storefront as well because this is so cute so I'm gonna put pampers diapers all the good stuff in here I got him this little set this is 12 to 18 months which is good because he can grow into this look at this like stop have you seen anything more cuddlier than this girl this boy gonna be styled out. What are you talking about? I think this is like my favorite. One of my favorite outfits so far. It's cool to be kind. And it has a little pants that goes with it. Along with the little bandana thing. Full in for mommy. Like, so cute. So putting some of his clothes in the drawers and trying to see what I don't want to put in the drawers because like for example this is 12 months this is 18 months he's not going to be wearing this for a while so my thing is do I put it in the closet do I put it into the dresser I'm just trying to figure out how I want to organize things and then we also got him uh, my brain's not processing what this is right now Laundry, that's what this is for. I just don't know. Laundry basket, hamper, whatever you call it. Guys, I'm just so happy and I feel so blessed to even be in this room preparing for things like this, you know? I don't feel safe about that. Like, this doesn't feel safe. Like, does something go under here? You guys let me know. All little things, but it's the little things like this that just gives me so much joy and happiness. I'm guessing just so like. Yeah, it's So what this does, you guys already know what this does. I ain't even gotta tell y'all. Y'all already mothers, but super cute. Okay. I'ma really be in here like Goo Goo Gaga. Goo Goo Gaga. Goo Goo Gaga. I can't wait. I just want my boy to be here. Like, can you come already? I'm just so excited, you guys. Like, oh, I'm just more than. I wish you guys can understand how I feel right now. Because I'm really happy. <laughs> 